What's up guys, my name is Fakun Thousand here, and in this video I'm going to be showing you guys a glitch that works on all Infinite Warfare Zombies maps such as Raven the Redwood, Zombies in Spaceland, Challenge Shuffle, and this will most likely work on Beast from Beyond. So, I'm going to be showing you guys how to actually get unlimited retries, meaning you can keep doing the Ghosts and Skulls over and over again on any map that has Ghosts and Skulls, and only doing one step, which is doing the last step. So, it's a really easy glitch, and this is pretty overpowered considering you just get like a Perkaholic really easily if you guys are having a lot of trouble with the Ghosts and Skulls. This will definitely help you out. But enough talk, let me show you guys how to do this glitch in your own game. So like I said, it works on all maps and you will need to have a friend in the game to help you. Make sure he is not the host and make sure that he does have this card right here called Skull Hacker. Once he does have that card equipped into his card pack, you guys can go ahead and start it on any map that you do want to do Skull Hacker or Ghosts and Skulls on. We did it on Attack of the Radioactive Thing. And what you want to do is you want to make sure that your friend has his card ready to go. Tell them to activate it and have everyone in the game actually go in the Ghost and Skull machine. Once you guys are in the machine, you guys want to go ahead and actually fail it on purpose. Now, when it does say you have failed, it'll say it like literally in the middle of your screen. Whenever it does say you failed, you want to have your friend that activated the Skull Hacker actually quit out of the application as fast as he can. As soon as he sees you failed, you want to tell him to quit out of the application really, really quick. And then it'll actually take you guys back out of the, the the machine. Once you guys are actually back on the map, the glitch has basically been done. All you got to do is actually just wait for your friend to get timed out. Once he actually has been timed out, you guys are basically done with the glitch. Now, what it's actually going to be doing to the Ghost and Skulls machine is it's actually going to be glitching out to where it's actually on the fifth skull. It may say zero out of six skulls, but you guys are actually on the fifth one. So you just got to simply just do the sixth skull. And there you guys go. So for the skull or for the last skull on attack of the reactive thing, all you got to do is just shoot the ghost and skulls machine with the MAD. And there you guys go. So as you saw there before, I just activated it and I can go in as many times as I want. Even if I fail a bunch of times, I can go in there and retry over and over again. You just got to do the last step of the ghost and skulls machine. This is a great glitch if you guys are having a lot of trouble with the ghosts and skulls you guys can just definitely do this glitch and you guys are ready to go and getting a perkaholic. Now in the video you guys see I am being a very very big noob. I really don't know how to play ghosts and skulls honestly so I apologize if it's a really bad gameplay and all that stuff. So other than that I hope you guys have enjoyed this video. Yeah guys for Kunst 2002 signing out.